क्वेश्चन इज फॉर्म द पार्शल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन बाय एलिमिनेटिंग द आर्बिट्री फंक्शन ऑफ द इक्वेशन जेड इज इक्वल टू एफ ऑफ एक्स प्लस एटी प्लस जी ऑफ एक्स माइनस एटी सो गिवन डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इज गिवन इक्वेशन इज एफ ऑफ एक्स प्लस एटी प्लस जी ऑफ एक्स माइनस एटी सो यू कैन सी हियर Uh, we have two functions f and g are two functions if two functions are there so the given z we have to differentiate z uh, twice means second order so in the previous example we have seen it is only uh, one function phi that's the only one time uh, partial derivative but here two times for both x as, as well as y so first time we'll do with respect to x as well as y so if you differentiate z with respect to x what happens here that is do z by do x which is nothing but p is equal to so we have this is a separate term no product rule because plus sign is there so we have differentiate this separately so differentiation of f of x plus 80 is what here f dash of x plus 80 80 plus g dash of x minus 80 so this is the first difference with respect to x see here the given z is a function uh, uh, having two function but two independent variables are x and t here in the previous example x and y was there here x and 2 are the two independent variables so we have to differentiate one with respect to x then with respect to t not with respect to y because here no y function so you have you need to check which are the two independent variables here x and t are the two independent variables so first we'll uh, in, uh, differentiate with respect to x then we'll differentiate with respect to t but partially so i had done with respect to uh, x for the given equation then we'll go for what here uh, i will give equation number 2 for this with respect to t now and do z upon do t is equal to you differentiate with respect to t it happens what here so f dash of x plus 80 into derivative of x plus 80 with respect to t partial is what here 0 plus a because we are differentiating partial with respect to t so t differentiation of uh, t is 1 uh, a is left plus g dash of x minus 80 into bracket this bracket uh, partial derivative with respect to t is what here 0 minus a so here uh, we will not use this p and all will uh, continue directly because with respect to t it is so directly will go th uh, the main notations only so we have seen so with respect to x we got equation 2 with this uh, or i will rearrange so do z by do t is equal to it will be a into f dash of x plus 80 and here we have 0 minus a is nothing but minus that minus and this plus become minus a times it will be g dash of x minus 80 give equation number 3 but if you re rearrange anything uh, we are not because we have two functions we can't uh, do so we need to differentiate again 2 and 3 with respect to o, x as well as with respect to uh, t so again So equation two, equation two, we need to differentiate again partially with respect to x now. So this is our equation two. So it will become do square z upon do x square is equal to f dash of x plus 80 will become what here? F double dash of x plus 80 and partial derivative of x plus 80 with respect to x is what here? One leave it plus again. partial derivative of g dash of x minus 80 with respect to x is g double dash of x minus 80 and partial derivative of x minus 80 with respect to x is what here one only so this is equation number 4 and and again again differentiate partially equation number 3 this is our equation number 3 we need to differentiate 3 partial with respect to t now so it will become do square do z upon do t square is equal to a as it is f dash of 
bracket will become f double dash of x plus a t into partial derivative of x plus a t with respect to t is what here. So x is 0, a t will become what here a minus this a as it is. So g dash will become what here g double dash of x minus a t into partial derivative of x minus a t with respect to t is what here minus a. So on simplification dou square z upon dou t square is equal to a into a will become a square f double dash of x plus a t minus minus plus a into a is a square g double dash of x minus a t. Now among this you take a a square common. So if you take a square common it will become what here f double dash of bracket of f double dash of x plus a t plus a is out a square is out so g double dash of x minus a t you can see this bracket is nothing but equation number 4 equation number 4 right hand side what here equation number 4 right hand side is f double dash of x plus a t which one we have here g double dash of x minus a t which one have we have so i can write this one as dou square z upon dou t square is equal to a square as it is this complete term what i am rounding here this can be going to write it as equation number 4 which is what is equation number 4 left hand side it is dou square z upon dou x square by equation number 4 so therefore therefore so this is what here our required so dou square z upon dou t square is equal to a square into dou square z upon dou x square is p d